Welcome to the Hot and Spicy Aldi's Bread. Now that, sun blushed. Is the most similar to Tesco's sun blushed I've tasted. And it's round like that. Aldi is doing very well in this house. Well done, Aldi. Ice cold. Cheers. Good week. Oh, I needed that. It's warm. Yeah, good week. I hope so. God, I'll hit the spot there. <laughs> Sorry if you found that <coughs> rude. Um, right, I don't know what this this um, video um, is not. I don't think going to be in HD. Not that it makes much difference in here. Um, I'm trying another format on this camera just to see. Because um, the editing sometimes on on this can be a bit slower, so I'm just seeing if it, just it's it's a camera talk. It's just a different format to see if it's quicker, slower, blah blah blah. You only want to watch the damn thing now. We film it. Something different today. What are you having? Well, I'll tell you now what we're having. <laughs> chili. Mexican chili. That is. With rice, Mexican chili. Now it's stated on the package, because it's not made at home, disgracefully, it's very hot. So, and I must be honest, when it was cooking, it did not smell very nice. I thought I'm not going to like this. However, I did have a sneaky taste of the sauce, and it tastes quite nice. So, we'll see if there's any heat now in it. As in spice. Spice, sorry. And while that's happening, southern fried chicken. Look at that. Look at the skin on that. Only simple. And we're having this um, scorching hot chilli, Sainsbury's. Five chilli mark. It is hot stuff, that. Um, now, I can't feel any heat in that. Whether my taste bud taste buds taste buds from Yorkshire now lad get it down the lad whether um, they've gone or they're immune to it I don't know but so we're going to use this this is the extra hot um, habanero habanero that's not hot well Tabasco it's supposed to be extra hot this I'm going to add some of that to it here we go I will uh... go on. There we go. That's the old Tabasco. Just bear with me while we mix up here. Yes, yeah, so you're in good health, are you? You're having a good week? Are you out the weekend? In the pub? Friends round? Party? Wedding? Christening? Funeral? We've got professional mourners in this town. And what I mean by that is people that go to every funeral, whether they knew them or not. You can ask them, did you know them? Uh, not really, but um, I heard they were lovely people. Good food though, isn't it? God, I'm buried. Are you there for the food? And they asked me then, do you know them? They says, no. <laughs> I've got a bag with you, <laughs> donkey bag. This is nice, this. Mm. Mm. Nice change. Kidney beans. 
beef, garlic. Lovely. Mmm. Rice is on. Saying about um depends how old you are. Pubs. They used to have characters in them years ago. Some of the old boys would tell you stories and sometimes you knew it was a lot of crap. But you listened and it was funny, you know. And um <laughs> it's it's um yeah, it is characters and people and some people thought that they were Roy Orbison after two pints. And then somebody'd come running in. Is there cats fighting in here? No, no, it's just just her having a sing song. <laughs> no, good days, but um now it's it's different and it's just a if you're brought up on the pubs or in the pubs as they are now, you think well that that's how it is. But it's, uh, it used to be quite different years ago. People used to have a chat and a lot of it now is like this. Yeah. <laughs> no, I'm only joking. Well, it is like that really, yeah, but um, each to their own. Okay, have a snifter of that. Welcome to the shaving video. So, we're going to have a good dollop of this. Get a bit of heat on it. This is hot stuff, this. Good. Mm. Oh, yeah. Welcome home, baby. Welcome home. Mmm. Holy smoke! Do you have a... Mm, maybe he doesn't want him. No. Change of plan. I was going to say something then, but I thought maybe they wouldn't want to be mentioned. But, uh, nothing bad. Um, oh! If you were driving, was it where were we today? Saturday. Um, Wednesday. Wednesday. And you hooted at me. <laughs> Waving like hell. I was on my delivery. And I didn't recognise you. From the delivery, or and I know most people's cars, yeah, because I looked shocked, I didn't, I didn't expect it. So, if it was you, thanks for hooting, yeah, it's, it's nicer. One, <laughs> I might have told you, one time I was delivering away, and then this next minute. Creative. They've done it a couple of times. Fantastic that I love that. Is it what the old what do you call it? The Dixie um oh, I keep forgetting the name. Dukes of Hazard and Dixie Lee, isn't it? Robert E. Lee or Dixie, I can't remember the <coughs> I'm sure that'll be fired in the comments down below. It's called this! Thank you. Cheers, look at the head on that. If I was serving the pubs, hey, top it up, paying for half here, not half of froth. No, it's nice. I'm going to mention a few people in this just to say I hope um, 
the people that used to watch these videos but they don't now well they may watch them but don't comment nothing wrong with that just want to know oh hope you're okay if you don't watch now you won't know but um, Patricia Oaks hope you're okay if you watch if you um, who else is it there was um Oh, I've heard, I was going to say Terry, he watches me on this and the other channel, but he's, he's he said he won't be commenting, hasn't been too good. But he's getting better, so anyway, I know he's okay. Mark, Piggly Wiggly, is it? Um, he, was a, he, was a, he could write a book, Mark, with his comedy stuff. I know, if you're watching, don't worry, because I know you have trouble sometimes with your fingers and that. And it's an awkward thing to type. And that's why sometimes you'd see silly comments from Mark. He'd just type it knowing it's just like a code saying, am I right? Or I'm still alive maybe. But um, anyway, if you're watching Mark, don't worry about commenting. But I just hope you're okay. Over in the States. One of the brothers. <laughs> Somebody else. And um, Julie. She's on Denby. Hope you're okay. I forgot your channel, you know. And I must admit, Mexican chili and southern fried chicken go well together. Mmm. And um, with rice. Joy, if you're watching from it, I may have thanked you before. If I repeat myself, I'm sorry. Because I must admit, a lot of times I'm talking to someone in person. And I'm talking about a subject, and it's gone. And I said, what was I saying then? And they I don't bloody know, do I? I'm, some, I'm double your bloody age, aren't I? <laughs> <laughs> Two of us have forgot what... Anyway, um... <sighs> See, I've forgotten now. Yeah. Um, mind you I'm up early uh, in the morning got a couple of packages I might be doing I might be doing um, a video on um, a few things have, things have arrived uh, a couple of things of kitchen stuff um, mm, but some are camping related uh, just upgraded a few things and just um, oh, this is beautiful excuse me oh. I hope you haven't just come in from the pub watching this and you've got nothing in because you're stuffed nothing worse than that I was sat here once watching and I've had a few drinks sat here and I think oh I didn't have hadn't been shopping or something I didn't have and this fella's eating fish fish and chips but fish he ate the fish with his hand like that <laughs> it's annoying. Oh God! When you got nothing in, it's annoying. <laughs> Turn it off. I think I made some toast, doesn't it? Anyway, I'll be back. Um. Just turn that off. Oh yeah. Hard to believe. Um, <coughs> talking to a, a... I'll swing for him, I tell you that now. He's crafty though, because he lets his wife drive sometimes. So, nobody, that he, so he can hide. A bit loud, isn't it? Do you, 
Give it to me, delicious ice cream from Italy. <laughs> that was good advertising, that Cornetto. You never forgot it, because the song, a lot of uh, adverts in the, the early years, like the old John Smith's adverts, they were little films of themselves, absolutely fantastic way of advertising. But, uh, these days, of course, it's all this, this. You can't advertise cigarettes. You can't advertise drink. No, you won't be allowed to talk soon. No. Anyway. Oh, there, 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 there. <laughs> okay, I'm going to finish these with a bit more of this. A few more um, slurpees, and that's it. Have a great weekend, Sunday. Um, no Lashentos tomorrow, Natalie. Uh, afraid to say. I'm having a change. I'm having um, mashed potatoes with a roast smoked gammon joint, which I'll slice. And then I can have it cold and have it in sandwiches and stuff after. With some marrow fat peas and some. I don't know, I'm thinking. I enjoy bread sauce, you see. Bread sauce. Um, I'll have some of that. But. Uh, Homemade, of course. But uh, so that'll be it tomorrow. And uh, yeah, so have a good weekend. Thanks again, and I'll see you in the next video. Got a couple of uh, out and about ones, and then one, as I say, showing a, just a bit of kit I bought, um, upgrading a few things. Uh, well, hopefully they're upgrading a few things, and that's it. So anyway, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Take care.